Good evening, friends. I have an adorable bath bomb from Salty Sailor Apothecary. There is no name of, of the bath bomb on the label, and there is also no scent. Um, I'll have to put it in the description for you. It smells sweet, like conde. Um, I'm trying to think. I really, I can't remember. Uh, I know that I saw the name of this when I did the unboxing, but I just can't remember right now. And um, I'll just put it in the description. But it's adorable. Let's take a peek. It's nice, quiet foam. Um, just regular foam, no foam pillow, as I usually say, like when you drop the bath bomb in there and it just explodes in foam. It's just a nice, quiet, steady foam. Um, I'm thinking there are embeds in here from what I had on the last uh, bath bomb demo that I did from them. And although I do I have no problem with this kind of foam I do prefer the thicker foam because then we all these bubbles that were popping up um, are not as um, so what I'm looking for they're not as you can't see through them and they don't like make popping noises and um, it's okay but it's not necessarily my favorite thing to see all of these um, as my friend calls them farters farting you could actually hear them popping um and usually if it's a really really super foamy bath bomb you don't hear any of that but eventually they'll stop popping i think sorry i had to stop my uh camera because it looked like the lens was kind of not it was kind of dirty or something because it wasn't uh very clean so i'm back and it looks a lot more vibrant now and again, maybe this is like a sweetheart scent. It smells some, like some sort of candy. I don't know if you can hear the bubbles. Usually I put music on these videos so you won't be able to hear them anyway, but it's just like pop, 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 pop. pop. I'm sure you guys remember um, because I say it almost every time I do not like white bath bombs I really don't like I find them quite boring um, unless it's like Christmas time you know I find them okay at Christmas um, but I don't it's not my preference to have a white bath bomb um, but usually they have embeds in it that make up for it um, looks like it's taking, if this has embeds, it's taking forever to get to the embeds. Well, I'm sorry, not forever. This has not really been a long time, but it's more, it's longer than what I'm used to with other bath bombs. And, I'm not gonna lie, if this is purely white. Oh, wait a minute, I think I see a little color there. I don't know. Um, if this is purely white, I am going to be really disappointed. Um, but I know that it's a cute bath bomb, so. And I knew it was white when I got it. I know, I know. But it was just really cute. And I just wanted to see what it looked like with embeds. So hopefully they have embeds. I mean, it has embeds. So 
so we are um, you, I may have fast forward some of these portions but in real time we are almost six minutes in and no embed action yet and if there are any bath bomb makers watching if you'd like to give your customers a good show um, not all of us, but I can't speak for everyone, but I know that me and a bunch of friends of mine prefer that they're, that they're right on the edge so that we don't have to wait forever to get a show. Um, if we're taking like videos like this or whatever, I know some people just throw them in there, but um, throw the whole bath bomb in there. But, um, like, yes, it, this might just be a plain white bath bomb. But usually, um, for those bath bomb makers, for instance, Bay the Nerdy and Peaches of a Goddess, um, they put the embeds like as close to the edge as possible in a bath bomb. So the moment you lay the bath bomb down, it's instant color show. I love that. And this white, aversion to white for me isn't only with, um, bath bombs. I don't like white shoes. I don't like to see people wearing white shoes. I'm crazy. Um, I think white is really boring and easily sullied, easily dirty. So I don't wear white pants. Um, I have a few white blouses and I actually wore once a day and I got it dirty. Like it's just white is so annoying. Not only is it boring, but it's also annoying. I can wear red shirts all every day of the week and not spill a drop on my clothes <laughs> but the moment I wear something white I'm making a mess yeah this is a uh, seven minutes in no color I might just go ahead and drop it because this is um, evident that there might not be any real color to this and you know I'm not gonna be oh look there's no color there I'm not going to be impressed by every single bath bomb that comes my way. Um, and if I'm honest with you guys, it's cute. But based on the other bath bombs that I've gotten from this company, I'm a little, uh, I guess, disappointed in the whiteness of it all. But again, that's subjective. You may love a white bath bomb that just does nothing but white. You may not even care about the colors. I talk about a color, colors a lot because I'm a very arty, creative person. And so my thing is colors. I, I'm a very visual type person. Like I won't go to Walmart, even though I know I'll save money. I'll go to Target because it's more aesthetically pleasing to my eye. <laughs> I know I'm crazy. I know. Um... I would hate to dunk this if there's an embed in there somewhere. But I think that's just a little you see right there there's a little bit of blue. I think there's just some there's just some drops of color in here somewhere. I saw a little pink, I mean a little yellow earlier, but it was just like a fleeting, like maybe some color dropped into the batch. So I'm gonna go ahead and let it go because it's been nine minutes and I'm bored and I'm sure if um, you're bored as well, even if I did fast forward you're probably still bored all right let me see what happens when I let it go gone straight to the bottom oh but look the color tried at least stay on that's impressive usually the color just immediately disappears but this is giving me something to play with that black is serious there Oh, I see. It's a little deeper here. It's not just a... Look, and there, finally. Where are we at? Ten minutes? Ten minutes in. And, uh, I'm bad. That's not fun for me. Sorry. I have nothing against the company. I just am very... And it's a beautiful embed, and it's beautiful. It matches his... I wish it had come out sooner, because that blue against the pirate because he's always on the water would have made a beautiful beautiful demo oh look and i'm really upset um 
I can't tell people how to make their bath bombs, but I know how I like them, though. I know how I like them. And I'm always honest in my opinions on these bath bombs. The last bath bomb I got from this company, I was super, super impressed with. Um, and maybe it's impossible to put embeds towards the edge. Maybe they were big embeds and they were hard to put it towards the edge, but it's just not my thing. It's just not. Super soft crush and even more color. Let's see? Oh, yeah, beautiful colors. They all go great. I'm still just a little disappointed in um, the fact that it took 10 minutes. Um, that said, most people do not use bath bombs the way I do. They don't sit around and just hold it up till the color comes out and do demos, but some of us do. And so because of that, I have a preference of how I like my bath bombs. All right, so um, let's see if this added any color to the tub. These colors are so vibrant. And like I said, the last bath bomb that I had from this company, I loved and I was super impressed with and the color came out way sooner. So it might just be the nature of the shape of this beast. So let's go ahead and see what's underneath. All right, all right. This is a pretty um, green color. And I am, I'm looking for shimmer because there was a lot of what I saw as um, mica on the top. Um, and there is some shimmer in there, but I thought it would be a little more. I'm not upset about it. Not all bath bombs are shimmery, and I'm not going to sit and look at it the whole time I'm in it anyway. Um, but I did expect a little more shimmer from all of that mica that was on the top. Um, but it is a pretty little bath bomb. And if you don't mind waiting till the center of the bath bomb to get to the embeds, then it's a cool bath bomb. It was really cute. I'm probably going to be able to make a nice little uh, image to go with this. <laughs> but anyway, that's it for this one. Um, again, this is Salty Sailor Apothecary. I will talk to you guys on the next one.